A streamlined car flashes by at over 300 kilometers per hour. But there's no sound of an engine. This is an electric car propelled by motors and batteries. With eight wheels and more than 600 horsepower, it's a genuine supercar. It was developed by Professor Hiroshi Shimizu of Japan's Keio University. For over 20 years, he's been developing electric cars in a quest to promotion of environmentally friendly vehicles. Previous electric cars have been seen as lacking in power and speed. But the car Shimizu is developing is intended to reach 400 kilometers per hour. It will be the fastest electric car ever made. A high performance car with no exhaust emissions. Follow along as one year in its development unfolds. <laughs> the electric supercar is named Ilika. Full-scale development got underway in September 2003. On this day, Shimizu was working out details of the Alika's body using a full-scale clay mock-up. <laughs> Typically, only experienced engineers working for a car manufacturer can develop a car from scratch. But Shimizu has never been affiliated with any car manufacturer. While teaching university classes on environmental issues, he works with students in the lab to develop electric cars. Working to turn his vision into reality, he has funded a series of electric cars by applying for grants from government projects. He has received no support from car makers. This will be the eighth electric car his lab has made. Shimizu first tried his hand at building an electric car in 1983. He took the engine out of a used car that he got from a friend, then fitted the car with batteries and electric motors. At the time, he was working at the National Institute for Environmental Studies and was an amateur at building cars. So why did he begin electric car research? It all started with an instrument he developed to measure air pollution using laser beams. This pioneering development enabled instantaneous measurement of air pollution across the whole Tokyo metropolitan area. But Shimizu felt that simply taking measurements did nothing to actually solve environmental problems. Sensing the limits of his current research, he began to see the potential of electric cars.
After making four prototypes, Shimizu conducted full-scale development of an electric car in 1996. The result was a compact two-seater called Lucio. Shimizu was proud of the little car, which could do 150 kilometers per hour, be recharged at home, and squeeze through narrow streets. He promoted the car in Japan and around the world. People who test drove it gave it high marks. But no serious buyers materialized. And to Shimizu's disappointment, there were no inquiries from car makers. ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、